So oh. it's it's like kind of uh, talk about RJ. They just wanted to clatter right away, you know. RJ, you know, are planning on mazes today. Yeah. I don't know. I don't. Interesting I don't that RJ that. was uh, when they joined the, when he joined the group. There's no hang around shit. He was just you know everything was given to him on a silver platter. That's kind of what I they want. They want to work. Ooh. Was it not though? Was it not? I mean, Tell me was I think it's confusing. Not. I'm not saying if it wasn't. I'm just saying. Hey, so he was with Future, right? Forehead, he was with Future, future right? And then Future said he should probably. Give him more time before you, you bring him in, but he yeah. was part of it anyway. Yeah, exactly. I literally How said that happened. I literally said, I said this. I said, give RJ more time. Don't bring him in right away. Let everybody, you know, figure out how he is, get accustomed to him, hang out with him, and then, you know, get everybody's mm -hmm. opinions based off that. Nah, they just instantly fucking brought him in because guess what? He had money and was, he was getting materials. <laughs> Wait, am I lying? Am I lying? Is that what happened? <laughs> Wasn't Hazel in the besties at one point? Yo, Khaled with yeah, the 10 gifted. Dirty. Khaled, thank you so much, bro. I love you, bro. Thank you. Always showing love. And, and groups are pretty good. Straight fuck up, Rock Pull this shit, too. <laughs> Appreciate you, bro. Thank you so much. What's your next, Hazel? Hey, oh, shout out everybody. Shit, Iron Man. What are you up, thinking? Thank you, guys, so much. I appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all showing love. Again. Come on, thank Iron so Man. Much. Speak up now. Wait, sorry. What did you say? What happened? I was. Uh, I was I'm, I'm was getting kicked out before RJ. Why? Why? Say something. Say something. Go ahead. I said it. Say what did you say? I'm getting say kicked anything. out before RJ. No, no, Julian. What do you say? Go ahead. What, what, what said, it's Hazel RJ. He said. I said. I said. Is RJ the next Hazel? <laughs> and he said, well, I don't know. What do you think, Iron Man? And I was. I think I'm getting out of the game before RJ is. I don't know, bro. I don't know. Uh, I mean, we had a we had a good talk with RJ why yesterday. Why would you go but... out of the game? Yeah. Why would you? Hold on. Hold on. Why the fuck would you? Why, why, why would you think yeah, that? Yeah, why, why, why would you think that, bro? It was, just, it, was a, it was like a joke. Me and fucking future scream at each other all the time. We know it's yeah, not serious. Yeah, but the problem is you fuck with me, I don't fuck with you. That's a problem. Like I don't, bitches. That's the thing. You know, I don't fuck with you either, bro. You just... No, you do fuck... You love me, bro, because I'm like your father, right? You just like RJ, bro. Motherfucker, say, bro, bro, you should have been there, Julian. Dude, RJ, a grown ass man. Me. You never look at Wait, me. RJ, a grown ass man, and is mean over here saying you're my mentor. You're like a father figure to me. You're the only one I respected. <laughs> like, I look up to you. I want you to teach me. You never teach me anything. Like, I'm like, bro, what is you like? You a grown ass man? What are you telling bro, me all this shit that? for? <laughs> like, I ain't sign up to be somebody's fucking father, bro. I'm a, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a gang banger. You know what I'm saying? Leave me the fuck alone. Yeah, RJ said that shit. Yes, ask Poe. Poe was there here the whole thing. Come a little close. Come a little closer. Okay. Wait. What the fuck? Okay. The thing so, is, I no, Poe. Go, 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 go ahead. Go ahead. Tell him. Go ahead. Tell him what RJ said. Go ahead. Tell him what I wish he didn't say it the way he said it. If he just, if he just said, like, uh, you know, sometimes you guys scream at me and I don't know what to do to do better. Can you guys fucking? Answer me when I ask questions and shit, it would have been better. But he said, I look up to you. You're, the only, you're my mentor. You're the only person uh, whose opinion I care about. Blah, blah, blah. Look, I made up some lies saying that I call him mini future. Like, when the fuck have I ever called him mini future <laughs> lying ass? Motherfucker <laughs> lying out his I, ass. I, 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 know, I know you ain't never said that. All shit. my life, I ain't never said that. Shit. Fuck you, bro, talking about. Not even your own blood, you wouldn't say that shit. That is crazy. That's what I'm saying, bro. And I dead ass told him shit. Many future, face. but in what way though? He, he, I don't he, fucking he's know. To speak. I might have joked around and said like, "You my son," but I've never said many fucking future fucking Wait, bro. But talking getting about. sunned is crazy when you take it like that though. Getting sunned is like disrespect. <laughs> But he took it as a fucking. Uh, as like, he took oh, it as damn, a compliment. I'm, like, I'm, oh, I'm son, honored no to be God. your son. Like, you know. <laughs> I got the son, but. <laughs> oh God, he's he and the, oh, and he also told me he's like, you know, I try and I try and copy you and I try and do the shit you do and he does though. And he said that, and I was like, and I told him I was like, bro, why you lie? I never show you how to dress like that. Why are you wearing that <laughs> corny, goofy ass shit in front of me? Wait, wait, so. The thing is, I'm confused about when he was with you before. I mean, he's saying that you change or whatever, right? Nah, he's so he changed like, the most, Poe. You know how he the, was before, ex, ex, bro. Explain this to me then, okay? Yeah. If you were the one that's... It's, all right, let's move here. Next spot, next spot. Come on, bro. Uh, The problem is RJ. RJ had his own... RJ was his own person before. And now he's he's trying to be a mini future. But explain this then to me, okay? If you were supposed to be the one that has changed so much, then how come that when he was with you before... He would always call, hang out with me and Jay, do Sandy this, do jobs that, talk, you know, do this. And in the moment that he became part of the gang, stops texting, stops calling me. And when I call him to ask him to do something or do Sandy, it's always, no, I'm doing something. I'm telling later. you, bro, he's changed the most out of anybody. I, I haven't spoken or hung out with him once. 
Take the take Since this the January shit for instance. That changed him. Take him catching a fucking attitude. That changed. Catch him fucking overstepping boundaries and not knowing his fucking place and position. That changed. This dude has like this dude like I'm telling you, he got everything served on him on a silver fucking platter, and now he thinks shit's sweet. I love YJ, but it's hard for me to explain how he can do better. Bro, we you and I we used to talk about like. I like, remember like he was on the back of the he was doing the the sandy stuff with like a bunch of random ass people with Jet Black and some other people and then he he already promised us to do sandy with him before and he was afraid to tell the guys he was with that he already had made plans. That's what I'm saying. And remember he was like soft. We were Dude to was scared of Ming. <laughs> I just don't understand. You'd say Ming around him, he'd start shivering, look behind him. Is that true? What do you mean? Is that true? Papa, Kuchi used to go up to him. In his, in his ear like this, and he goes like this. Aging time, <laughs> <laughs> bro, bro, you don't know about that. How do you? How is you don't know about that? Me? You don't know about that. Look, you, 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 you don't know about that. Dude, call me <laughs> up. He's like, he's like, I need help. I was like, now nah, we're busy. Call up Ming. He'll help you. He's like, uh, no, nah, no, nah, nah, I got it. I'm like, bro, call up Ming. No, 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 I got it. I got it. Don't worry about it. I'm like, bro, I call up Ming. No he will way. help you. Dude was scared to call up Ming. Then he was scared to fucking talk to Ming. He didn't want to fucking talk to Ming. And Ming was like, yo, this shit is mad fucking awkward. Why? Like, he's making it awkward. I'm like, he's just a little scaredy bitch, bro. He's scared of you. <laughs> he was You're dead ass. Lying. He was dead ass. Julie, my lines. So on my life in my line. There's no no way. Way. I'm not lying, no, and, bro. And the thing is, this, this was happening not just with Ming, but also with like Sandy workers and shit. And even Fanny you. called him a me little and, baby me back and him have been bitch. trying to figure this shit out. This was an issue before. We tried to help him. But like, yo, just, just say what it is, man. And I had to call the guys in the Sandy truck. Be like, yo, RJ already made some plans. He promised us to do a Sandy today in the morning. So y'all got to bounce, man. You know, it'll only come with you next time. I had to call the, the dude next to him, the Sandy worker, to tell him that they, they're going to split. Like, bro. Mm. Bro, bro, and the thing is that I told him to a face. I was like, bro, you a little bitch. Like, how are you scared of the leader? Like, how are you not going to talk to him? And then motherfuckers, they started getting on my ass. Like, you do like, something to be scared of him? Uh, li listen, they, they were like, they're like, stop <laughs> being so mean. Don't call him a bitch. Just let him figure it out. And then, like, five minutes later, Fanny calls him a fucking That's little scary bitch. And then everybody's laughing and giggling. I'm like, oh, so it's cool when she says it. But when I say it, it's a fucking problem. I don't get how. I don't know. How? Why Ming though? Four hit will pull a gun on you sometimes. Because Ming's four words per minute, so it's intimidating. You know what I'm saying? Like, that is. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't it's say anything fast, scary. Fast, fast I mean, if you don't know Ming like that, Ming's probably won't talk to you like how he talks to like us. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. So RJ yeah. really didn't know Ming like that, and Ming would barely talk to him. And when Ming did talk but to it, him, he's probably been the scared case, as though. fuck. Throughout the years with Ming, bro, every time we deal with people like that, just. You know, like are a little bit more sensitive. They always immediately like are like intimidated because it's just this. But they don't realize Ming's just there, like just not talking. He, he's not mean. You know, he's not eyeballing your fucking mug eye on you. He just doesn't <laughs> want to talk, bro. That's nothing to do with him trying to intimidate you. If you need to know the guy, you know he's a fucking yo. Know? Yeah. Little sweet patootie, bro. I mean, shit. But back to the shit I was saying about RJ at the meeting, bro. I'm telling you, he was like. He, he, dead ass, I told Farhead too. I was like, bro, it felt like I was talking to Tic Tac in there, bro. Like, literally. You never look at me. You never even look my that way. Looking at, I'm like, I told RJ, I was like, bro, all I want you to do, you don't need to say sorry. Uh, you're not disrespecting me. I just told him straight to his face like I told him the day that happened. I was like, learn your fucking place. Know where the fuck you're at. Know who the fuck your leaders are. Know when you can and can't do shit. And when you step out of fucking line, don't take it to heart when motherfuckers fucking check you and tell you where the fuck you are. Just like I told him. Because trust me, I've, I've stepped out of line too. Motherfuckers checked me before in the past. And I've learned, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? I take the ratchet example. Take the ratchet shit, for example, you know? I, I learned from my mistakes. I had to step back in line. And I had to do what I had to fucking do. It's funny as fuck. I never knew he was scared of me. And then sometimes, oh, I'm not going to lie. Sometimes y'all motherfuckers are the problem too. Well... Cause y'all be bringing up the ratchet shit and then the list and shit like that, and like y'all be scaring these motherfuckers, bro. Like y'all are part of the fucking problem. Yeah, but, yeah, but we we know what you yeah, shit. Y'all are part of the fucking problem, are. bro. We just we RJ just needs to learn. Yeah, he just does. He, he 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 exactly. He he says. Wait, I see how is this just by the way? This fucking planting shit, bro. Yeah. How many did he put in each one? Nine. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, man. 
<laughs> Ratchet, you mean Chris? Nah, I'm talking about Ratchet, dumbass. <laughs> Yeah, That's he was. Crazy. He's like, he's like. Whenever I make mistakes, all you do is fucking yell at me. And I'm like, I, I told him, I was like, I do that to fucking everybody. Like, you're not special. Like, dude is taking this shit to heart. He thinks he's special. You think know. he'll last? Um, I think he. I think if he if he wants if he learns to... from his his mistakes, yes. But if he goes back to what he keeps doing and overstepping and having an attitude and shit like that. Probably not. If he wants to, he can. He can fix the problem. Yeah, he can fix it. It's up to him to fix it. If he learns from his mistakes and he listens to fucking people, oh, one hundred percent, he'll be. I'm here glad for a he while. at least listened to what you said because I feel like if I hadn't talked to him beforehand, he would have just tried to excuse everything. Make sure it's all got nine each. These pots are gonna break. Trust me, I, I fuck with RJ. You know, I'm saying there's a reason why I brought him to the crib. Yeah. But at the same time, it's like. Again, he didn't build up the connections that we had, you know? He didn't really know people like that. He he didn't have that same, like, bond slash connection everybody else had because we've known each other for so long. He didn't have to really work for anything. All he really did was just contribute fucking money, and he got in. He pretty much kind of bought his way in if we're keeping it a buck fifty. Am I lying? <laughs> yeah, I don't That's know. Insane. I mean, uh, it's, it it's insane, but I mean, it's the truth. I mean, I'm not saying it in a disrespectful way or I'm hating on him. Like I said, I still fuck with him. It's just, it, it's yeah. just, and some people, whenever they buy their way in or something like that happens, they don't value it like other people that had to work fucking crazy for it. You see what I'm saying? They don't value yeah. it as somebody else. Also, I think uh, these two plots are going to break after I harvest these, this, this uh, cycle. So I got to buy more plots, but uh, it's for later. Also, I got the 4,000 if you want to get the 